Hello, dear subscribers. Thank you for coming in. I am so pleased and so excited that we are starting our recording of this chapter. What you are in for, what you have applied for, is the customer service principle. What are the customer service, and what is customer service? What are the customer service principle? Customer service, you expect that to be either a call center where you phone and somebody answers your call. Yes, you are right. That is one part of it. Then there is a restaurant, food and service. Then there is hospitality, hotel, where you are greeted, where you are taken care of, where you are put at ease. Your wishes are looked after. They foretell what you are planning to get. They have planned everything so that you don't have to ask for the things which are expected from that place. We are going into the degrees of the customer service later on. Now let's start with the customer service, and that is looking after the needs of the people. Who are your patrons? Who are going to purchase from you? Why would we go into this customer service profession? That's your livelihood. There are other professions, many professions. People who choose customer service are a unique group. They are very, very special people. I'm not saying to make an excuse because you could not do your engineering, because you could not, you did not have the aptitude to become a doctor, or so and so. What I'm trying to say is that customer service people are a special group for the reason, for the very special reason that they like meeting humans. They want to be in that atmosphere where they interact with their fellow human beings, and they have a desire to make people smile, to make people happy, to give them their money's worth. Not only that, in this breed, when we come to the degrees, there will be people who are not satisfied just to give you your money's worth. They go the extra mile. They are not satisfied till they get a pleasing referral, a comment, or a thank you, or a gratefulness from the people they are serving. The word "serving" may not sound very good to everybody. It looks like we are servants. Now you will be surprised of what I think of customer service. As servants, no. I think that the customer service people are slaves. Have I shocked you? I intended to shock you. We are slaves. By the, that I mean that we have our own rules, our own principles. We stick to them like slaves. We will never be rude to a customer. We will never fight back with a customer. We will never argue with a customer. We will always apologize if there is some mis-service happens where the customer is not happy. Maybe they are blaming one of your colleagues, maybe some other department. We do not throw the blame and let them continue with that. We will try to calm them down and take the blame. We apologize because we are in front of the customer. We are the people representing that organization. That organization is in the business of making money through providing services to the customer, and for that they need your services. You are a link between the organization and the customer. You are a partner with that organization. So when I say you are a slave, you are slave of your own. Rules and regulations which you yourself can apply and you yourself can follow. Nobody can force you to follow those rules because they are your own rules, your own principles. 
forcing people to do something they can many things can be done by just ordering blackmailing intimidating shouting but customer service can never never be achieved that feeling that hap- that uh, confidence and that happiness which vibrates and is also felt by the customer when they walk in so let's start with this customer service chapter 1 here they will be telling you about customer service you will be reading it and what i we are planning in this and we have set up in this course is you will not find this and i can guarantee you you will not find the way we are conducting this course is that we are always available for your questions for your you can chat with us you can email us you can go to facebook you can tweet us or whatsapp or whatever media is there you can contact us we will be responding to your questions because we are not here just to get the money by selling this course we ha- we have a target of making as many professionals of customer service not only here in dubai but online anywhere in the world please believe me when i say that you are in the best honorable profession in the world how would i know that how why would i say that because i am one of those people i started at the age of 18 in this profession i am now 68 years old retirement yes i can retire i and my wife we can go to vacation and we have never taken a vacation now 5 years only we go home to our country just to meet our relatives or some something happens there we are very happy because the happiness we get is from people we are dealing with the people we are serving believe me you will forget your health problems you will forget your monetary problems you will have no time to worry because you are making other people happy so in this chapter i'm because with this video is not to explain the chapter that you will be getting there and as i said any question anything you don't understand you can write to us so this was chapter number 1 now i'll go to chapter number 2